Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. As I'm laying here in my hospital bed, I was reflecting on this amazing hadith. And this hadith teaches us that you know, sometimes the greatest blessings that we have, they're right in front of us, but we don't realize them. We don't realize how great of a blessing they are until they're gone. And that is in the hadith that was narrated in, in Sahih Bukhari, that our beloved Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Ni'matani maqboonun fihima kathiru min nas that there's two ni'mas, two blessings that many people incur loss. They're in loss when it comes to these blessings. They, they lose out on them. What are they? As-sihatu wal faraq Good health and free time. And why are these two so important? And why are they such great blessings? Because with our good health and with our free time, we're able to accomplish so much in bettering ourselves in this life and also in preparing ourselves for the hereafter. Therefore, if you have good health and you have free time, take advantage of them now before they're gone. And prepare your answer now. Your answer to what you're going to say to Allah Yawm al Qiyamah on what you did with the good health and the free time that He gave you. Because Allah is going to ask us about those things. What did you do with the health? You were healthy, alhamdulillah. What did you do with it? You had a lot of free time. What did you do? Were you bettering yourself, becoming better, to better yourself, to better this ummah and this life? Were you taking out time to worship me and to be thankful and to prepare yourself for the hereafter? Or you were from those sitting around wasting your time. And one of the main objectives of this hadith is for us to sit there and to think that subhanAllah, these are two of the greatest blessings as the Prophet ﷺ is mentioning, and I have them. So what am I going to do with them? And how can I take advantage of them to better myself? Mm -hmm.